Hi, this is Jason with Yellow Dell Scientific showcasing our car service management application. The first thing you're going to want to do is upload your JPEG for branding of the system. This is simply done by creating a JPEG on your local machine and saving it as logo.jpg to the proper folder. Once this is done, we can see that the system now displays our logo. Because our system is Excel based, it allows you full customizable options by simply manually manipulating the various columns in the backend file. The backend Excel file contains columns that house the data for the various dropdowns and list menus within the system. In this example, we're easily adding another item to the listing of services that we offer in our car repair shop. We can also add technicians, either by name or ID, simply by adding the information into the proper column. Similarly, we can update details about cars, makes, and models that we intend on servicing in our shop. This is all fully configurable by you. Now that we have the system set up, creating a new service record is incredibly simple. Simply fill in the client's name and information. Enter details about the client's vehicle. Remember, these dropdowns are fully configurable by you on the back end. In this example, we will select that the client is interested in a custom exhaust upgrade. We will also add man hours to this particular invoice. When saving the service record, the system will prompt you to take a deposit. This is optional. However, let's add $500. And just like that, we're done. And we can now see that we have one record that is pending. There are a couple different ways to view existing records. From this window, we can select a particular order and see the details on the right pane. We can then click open and it will open up the particular service record. Another way is using the search engine. We can search for a name such as John to generate a listing of all orders that match the criteria. We can select it and then click open to launch the service record. At any time, when looking at a service record, you can send an email to the client by clicking on send message. You can populate this text entry field and then click send. This will automatically send an email to the client. Here we can see that the email was automatically sent using Microsoft Outlook. To update the record, we then click on job status. Here we can set the actual status of the service record, such as complete or urgent problem. In this example, we'll select that it was completed without issues. The system will then alert you that there is an outstanding balance on this service record. At this time, we can accept payment to finalize. And just like that, there are now zero records pending. A full e-receipt can be generated by clicking on e-receipt. The system will then allow you to automatically email the client this e-receipt by simply clicking on send message. If we check Microsoft Outlook, we can now see that the message was sent.